Hello you guys and welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name is Drew if you're new here and welcome back to the Basham family vlog. <laughs> Okay, so today we are on the way to go pick out our washer and our dryer. You guys came with us. Also, I got some fake hair. Um, you guys came with us last time. I'm trying to figure out where to put her. I'll put her up there. But she failed last time. Okay, put her down. Um, but anyways, you guys came with us last time to pick out our refrigerator. And so today we're going to go pick out our washer and our dryer. So I've done a lot of research and I've also asked you guys a ton of questions because asking questions does not sink and hurt. We also need to get our passports, but I don't think we're getting our passports today. We're probably going to do that next week, so stay tuned for that. If you have any tips on passports, let me know. Okay, so we're just gonna get, y'all are gonna get ready with me with my cutesy little Diet Coke and vanilla. And um, so today we got our refrigerator from a Treasures for Less, but I think we're going to get our, um, our I wanna say microwave, our washer and our dryer from I think Best Buy, but there's also a clearance outlet place in, um, in Houston somewhere, so we might go to that one. I'm trying to figure out where all my stuff is. I can't find anything. One second. Yeah, I can't find any of my makeup. I have literally, I said yesterday, two seconds worth of foundation left, and then I have this concealer. It's more on a pink tone concealer, so I'm probably just gonna drag it across the face because it's more of a, oh, I have a scratch on my face. It's more of a foundation color for me than it is a concealer color, but I did a lot of research. I originally wanted a Maytag washer because why the heck not? The things are so bougie and they're like the most rated things in America. Um, but after doing some research and talking to a lot of people, a lot of you guys said that it's not a good idea because they are so bougie that you have to do certain types of maintenance on them. Meaning like every three months you have to maintenance them. Every three months you have to do this and that. You can only use like clear and free detergent. And y'all know your girl is literally not a free and clear detergent girly. I love Diva. I love Scentsy. I love Tide. I love Gain. And so after a lot of research, I just... I just figured that I would get these super expensive machines and literally break them. So we're going to steer clear from them expensive things because they're honestly, for a set of Whirlpool ones, you can get one Maytag one for the price of two. And so I'm sitting here thinking, I'm gonna spend all this money on this amazing machine. And now the money is worth it from the people that I've talked to. Everybody that has a Maytag says it's the best thing they ever had. They're like really good machines. They do what they're supposed to do. They do what they claim they're supposed to do. And they're just really good machines they last forever because they're just so expensive and just really good um but i just know my personality and how i am i'm literally gonna break this 900 dollars machine in a day so i might as well stick to what i know and just get something basic and a lot of people including my mom and gabe's mom said the less technical the better so the less buttons and the less craziness that it has the better then a lot of the Maytag ones connect to your phone. And I'm like, why do I need to connect to my phone? Like, I don't need to connect to my phone. Like, if I'm going to be washing the clothes, I don't need my phone. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm going to put on some of this lighter concealer just because I want to. And I put that pink concealer on my face. I feel like my face looks very pink. Um, but yeah, so we're going to go there. There's a big old clearance outlet. So I don't know if we're going to go to the clearance or if I should just buy them straight from Best Buy or Lowe's or Home Depot. Does Home Depot, I don't think Home Depot sells supplies like that. Gabe, does Home Depot sell appliances? Um, I like that too. But anyways, we are going to do that today. And then I thought I would just do a get ready with me. I get ready really fast. Like, I do it like fast paced. <laughs> um, And right now, the ring light is underneath me. I feel like it needs to be right there. Look how much better I look with the ring light where it's supposed to be. Cause when it's underneath you, it like washes me out in a way. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna do a little get ready with me. So we have foundation and concealer on, and then now we're just gonna do my bronzer, blush, and eyebrows. That is all I really do for everyday makeup. I got in a new jacket. It's a Lululemon duped jacket, and I am so excited to wear it and show it to you guys. I will have it linked down below. I am like over the moon excited to wear this cute little jacket. You already know I use my elf uh, bronzer, and I just bronze like this. It's my favorite way to do it. Um, I know this brush has seen better days, but I love this brush. She has never taking me the wrong way she's always done me good never did me dirty um like some of these other brushes out there and my hair fell out of its clip but yeah comment down below what washer and dryer you have and 
after this video, if we decide to buy one today, I don't know if we're going to buy it today, but if we do, comment down below if I made a good choice because a lot of you guys have really good advice and I love taking y'all's advice and like using it. Like even like, you know, your mom can tell you something and your mother-in-law or your father-in-law or whatever, and they can tell you advice, but then when someone else says it, you're like, oh, that's the answer. That's it right there. That person knows more than everybody else. And you're just like, why do you do that? I don't know. Um. But now we're going to go in with my blush. It's a pink blush. I think I'm almost hitting pan on it. Um, a lot of y'all said that you can't get this blush um, on, like, the store. But I actually saw it at Ulta, and I buy mine on Amazon. But QVC has it as well. That is where my mom originally got it. Because it was my mom's blush, but she didn't like the color on her. So I took it. And I love it. I've had it for a really, really, really long time. And so um, I just put it on like crazy because I love blush. Um, but I got my, I have my link down below from Amazon, but you can also get it on QVC. You can also get it at Ulta. I saw it at Ulta, but some of y'all were commenting in my comments saying you can't get it at Ulta. And I was like, girl, why are you lying? I seen it at the Ultra yesterday. That was really loud. And then I fill in my eyebrows. I just do a little bit. Sometimes I feel like this eyebrow is fuller than this eyebrow. And when I fill them in, they look funky. Let's go ahead and fill these brows in okay so i just showed you guys over on tiktok but this is the dupe honestly you guys i'm very impressed i really like the material i like the way it looks the only thing that it does not have is a stinking little lulu emblem right there but honestly the material is really good i feel warm i feel cute honestly i think i could get a large if i were to get a large it'd give me that more like oversized look but this is a size medium i will have it linked down below for you guys but i would say this is a lulu dupe and it's really cute and comfy the only thing is is i have on these panties right now and they're like poking out right here it's making my hips look kind of funny but who cares i'm gonna put on some tinnies and i haven't decided i might wear my hair in a bun or should i put it or should i curl it we're just gonna do a bun today because we're gonna i think i'm gonna these. throw these on even though they're kind of dirty and they don't have hot pink on them they're just really comfy and i love wearing these shoes if you don't have a pair of these you're missing out i have I think I have, I think I just have two pairs, but they have a pair of all hot pink ones and I kind of want them because they're literally the best shoes. I love working out in them because this bottom part's like bouncy. So we're in the car. Guys, we are in the truck. The truck. I got my cutesy coat that matches the fit and we're going to try to find a Dutch Bros or a drink place over here where we're going. We decided to go to the um, appliance outlet. It's not like a known store. It's kind of like a Sheffield Sheffield, but just appliances right i've never been i don't know but i don't think they're used or returned so i think it's just like an outlet store no, they're, new. they're new they're all brand new like i don't then there's it's not a sheffield and sheffield because sheffield and sheffield is no sheffield is not used stuff but they're liquidation meaning it's a return it's like pallets and stuff yeah Okay, so they were literally like $10 cheaper here and they had scratches and bumps on them. So I'm thinking we should probably just go to Lowe's real quick or Best Buy real quick. Kind of see what they have and if the $10 off is better because we can get them today, then we'll do that. Because he was saying like the ones I want are like back ordered until May or something. Was that what he was saying? Uh. I don't know. I don't know. He said they're back over till March. We go to Home Depot, but I mean, that's, I mean, I'm go gonna, check 20 other We don't shop at Home Depot. We want to go to Lowe's. Dang, babe. That was good. That was good.
Okay, y'all, I literally wanted to buy those washers. for well, one, because they're my dream ones that I really want. I'm going to get them. My friend Lindsay, she does TikTok. Shout out to my friend Lindsay. Um, she has them, and me and her have been talking back and forth, and she says they're amazing, so that's why I was going to get them. Um, but we're going to wait a little bit, even though they're on a really good sale. But I wanted to shout out our friend Sam from Lowe's. He was literally the nicest guy ever. It made me want to buy them even more because he was just so cute and funny. Like, he's an older dude. He was just pretty cool. I liked him a lot. He was pretty fun. Um, so, yeah, now we're going to go get some lunch because Lovey has been asking for stinker crawfish so we're gonna get some stinker crawfish for the lovey and um yeah we almost got them today because they're on a really good sale they're like 200 dollars off yeah like 200 dollars off until february the first but we're gonna keep on looking try to go to a little bit more liquidation places and see if we can find them for a little bit cheaper and if we can't get them for a little bit cheaper we're gonna go ahead and go with Liz. So we just went to TJ Maxx and we got some stuff and we did a really good job. I'm gonna let you guys see what Gabe picked out. He never picks anything out when we go to TJ Maxx and today he picked oh something out. Oh, like, I keep almost getting hit today. Okay, so they had these huge bargain bags of the brand that we give our dogs. The Red Bull. It literally has how many things in here? A bunch. A ton of things. We got two of these bags. They had no price tag on them. And I was thinking maybe even at TJ Maxx, 20 bucks. She goes, will you get them for $6.99? I said, I'll take both of them. So we got yeah, two. She goes, I'm a $6.99 sign. We were I'm like, like $6.99? Yeah. Heck yeah. So we got, them, we got two bags of those. And then we got this high protein, low fat butcher shop, like stick thing. And then Gabe got this thing, you guys. I just. Yeah. I'm, when you're going on a spontaneous road trip and you're ovulating, you got to bring the goods. Even though this one is a pomegranate blueberry, I'm still going to drink it on my ovulation, even though you're supposed to drink regular. Um, but yeah, we're going on a spontaneous road trip. We'll see you guys on tomorrow's vlog. We love you guys so, so much. Stay tuned for tomorrow.